Be sure to share, like, subscribe, and comment down below. And make sure you turn on notifications by clicking on that bell icon. Now, the DOJ OIG releases report on retired FBI special agent found involved in numerous corrupt criminal acts. Earlier today, the Department of Justice Office of Inspector General released a report on the review of a retired FBI special agent involved in numerous activities that appear criminal in nature. Now, the Office of Inspector General, U.S. Department of Justice, their investigative summary says this, Findings of misconduct by an FBI special agent for contacting witnesses for an improper purpose, divulging law enforcement sensitive information to unauthorized individuals, providing misleading testimony, providing false information to the OIG, mishandling classified information, and misusing government devices and his position. Now, the DOJ OIG released the report today that shows that a retired FBI special agent involved in numerous what appear to be criminal acts. Now, they said, quote this, the Department of Justice Office of the Inspector General initiated this investigation after receiving information from the Federal Bureau of, Ed of Investigation, the FBI Inspection Division, alleging that an FBI special agent who has since retired may have contacted witnesses during a federal criminal investigation for an improper purpose. The OIG found that the SA contacted individuals who he either knew were or had re a reasonable belief would be witnesses in the criminal investigation and that the SA's contacts with several individuals appeared to be designed to improperly influence their prospective testimony. Now, accordingly, according Lee, the OIG concluded that the SA's contacts with the, with the witnesses were improper and constituted misconduct. Now, during the investigation, the OIG also found the SA divulged law enforcement sensitive information to unauthorized individuals, misused his government issued electronic devices, provided misleading testimony during a related civil deposition, mishandling classified information, misused his position during the con during contacts with the local law enforcement officers, and provided false information to the OIG. A criminal prosecution of the SA was declined. Now, the OIG has completed its investigation and provided its report to the FBI. Now, however, the real story is it is still currently un unknown who this report is about. So we're going to have to keep an eye on this. And as, as soon as I get some more information on who this possibly is, I'll definitely get that out to you guys. But I guess speculation could, I mean, I mean, who could this be? That's the question here. We don't know yet, but well, I'm sure we'll find out soon. It, but uh, if, if we find out uh, relatively soon, like I said, I'll get that out to you guys. Unfortunately, we don't know who this report is about yet, so we're going to have to wait on that. But be sure to share, like, subscribe, and comment down below. And uh, make sure you know and tell me how you feel about this report and uh, who who do you think this could possibly be? You know, I I don't. I mean, there's some names that come to mind who it could be, but I'm not going to speculate on that yet. But if you have any thoughts on who you might think it could be, go ahead and comment. But other than that, I hope you guys have a great day. Let's make America great again. Peace.